How do you protect yourself from the coronavirus when running water is limited and living conditions are crowded? In informal settlements like Kibera in Kenya, this is a challenge. But the young journalists of Shine Kibera TV are focusing on the solutions. They reported for CGTN from their home in Kibera on how kids are learning to protect themselves from COVID-19. Take a look. Bruce is a young man from Kibera. He is an actor and a scriptwriter. With the recent pandemic, all places of gatherings including theatres and social halls are closed, which means Bruce is not working as usual. He has now put his energy in teaching kids how to prevent themselves from getting the virus by teaching them how to wash their hands. This is the easiest and cheapest way to prevent the virus. Give them the knowledge uh, to sanitize, to wash hands, and how to keep good hygiene. I think that's a better way. Prevention is better than cure. The kids are learning bit by bit. The kids then learn how to keep a social distance and a proper way of coughing. social distance I realized they do not have masks. Bruce says their parents don't see it as a priority. You know, here there's things like budgeting that comes along. Uh, someone prioritizes should I buy the mask or food and stuff like that. And also they are, they are limited, the masks are limited. Bruce urges people to stand in unity and support one another. If there is someone out there who, has, who sees the urge and the need here in the ghetto, should give the, that that he has, he should share with others. It might look like a drop in the ocean, but these are the little things we can do to change the world in a big way. From Kibra, I am Sylvia Aziambo.